This is a new technology innovation from Power One, a microinverter from one of the largest uh, inverter manufacturers in the world. We look at the UK market as being quite a good market for microinverters. All of the indicators are that uh, microinverters in the UK will be successful because of small roofs, chimneys everywhere, and I think that uh, UK people like technology type products, so we're very optimistic that the microinverter will take on in the UK. We are currently introducing this new product called MicroRe Plus. The microinverter is independent from the module. The installer is free to do what he wants to do, to make a choice, I would like to have this and this and this. It's a very modular concept. We just launched this unit. Actually, the unit is the first time on an exhibition uh, right now. It's a combination. We have two existing units in there with outdoor housing around the DC um, cabinet in it. So that's just a result of uh, the proven technology with our 330, 360 inverters, which we have in our assortment since, uh, since uh, two years. And um, we just made a combination now for the outdoor um, solution. What we're showing here is the uh, new generation 3 of our polycrystalline Q-Pro module. The frame is new, it's slimmer and yet stronger. The design is uh, much more beneficial for the residential area. But that module is our uh, workhorse, so to speak. So we, deal, uh, we offer it for all applications, including utility, by the way. It um, has new cell technology inside, which we call Quantum. It's a high-performance, high-efficiency cell generation that we use here. Uh, also improving the temperature coefficient and the low light behavior of that specific module. Uh, we're using for the first time arc glass, so anti-reflective coated glass. So that product has been optimized in each and every detail. We deliver up to 265 watt for a 60 cell poly module that is quite remarkable. The carrying strengthening uh, construction piece is the module frame itself. It can be mounted very easily and quickly due to the fact that the module itself is not fixed to the installation but uh, just by plug and play, so to speak, uh, clicked into the mounting structure and holds itself, cutting cost in both material and installation.